Yo, what's up, creators? Welcome back to the channel. This is Lou from Luke MHD. If you guys are new to the channel, this is a film 101 channel. You know, we talk about tutorials, you know, behind the scenes and, and all that stuff. So today I'll be teaching you guys how to create animated crop bars or cinematic bars or um, letterbox bars or letterbox, whatever you call it. But I'll be showing you guys how to animate them into your screen, you know, into your video or whatever. So you'd see these cinematic bars in a lot of music videos, you know, they sort of bring your eye into the shot, you know, into the video. So they're quite effective. So without wasting any time, guys, let's just jump right into it. <laughs> Now we in Premiere Pro. What we're gonna do now is to go on the new item and then select adjustment layer. So this is gonna create an adjustment layer. Just take that and drop it on top of your footage. An adjustment layer is basically like just a clear layer where you can apply effects on without affecting the actual footage that's underneath so that's what an adjustment layer is so you can turn it on and off and animate it you know as as you like so the next thing that we want to do now is to go to our effects menu and then look for crop so just drag and drop it on your adjustment layer not in your footage on your adjustment layer so here we're going to keyframe our crop bars using the top button and the, and the bottom button. So we're just going to click this stopwatch for the top and the bottom. And then we're going to make this to 15 and then 15. As you can see, we already have our our bars right now. So now, if you want to animate this into the screen, what you want to do is to go at the beginning of your of your of your clip, right? So there's no bars as you can as you can see. We we're gonna make a keyframe right here for the bottom and the top. And then we're gonna move a few keyframes and then we're gonna make it you're gonna make it 15 15 so if you notice the 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 cinema bars are coming in So that's basically how you, you animate the cinema bars. It's that easy. And then if if you want it, you, you can make it, you know, to be slower by pushing this, you know, in time, like forward. So it's going to come in slower and stuff. Also, what I like to do is to go at the beginning of my clip and then make this to 50% and then make the bottom one also to be 50%. So it's, 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 uh, it's closed, you know, there's nothing. And then you go a few frames in time and then you just reset this and then you reset this so now what's what's going to happen now it, it, it's going to start off black and then it's just going to reveal what's happening like this so 
that's also another way you know to to maximize this sort of effect extend it just push it back a bit and then that's it that's how you animate your your cinema bars just using premiere pro and as always see you guys in the next one peace